Hey guys, welcome. It's Jack from CruiseCasinoMafia.com. So we arrived yesterday at about six o'clock. And let me tell you, I knew I was getting a nice room this time, but I had no idea, absolutely no idea when me and my dad came in, uh, this is the nicest suite I have ever stayed in in Vegas. I'll give you guys a glimpse of that at the end of the video. This is just a quick video, uh, giving you kind of a little bit of a trip update. So last night we got here, uh, we really took it easy. We took a walk down the strip, went to the Venetian, walked into Harris and a few other places. And one of the things that, um, that was on kind of my radar for this trip was to be able to play more craps this trip. The last few trips that I took, as you guys know, were a lot of testing and a lot of Baccarat. This is gonna be uh, mainly a craps trip and a little bit of roulette to uh, show my dad a few systems that we've been doing. We'll probably play some Baccarat, but nowhere near what's been going on the last few trips. I needed a break but we're probably going to do some Baccarat Cypher, which is the new system that all members got. So uh, with that being said, uh, everybody that's a member of Cruise Casino Mafia that has joined has gotten a bit of the playbook for this trip. And that means that you've gotten the actual systems that I'm going to be playing uh, with the links to the videos that showcase exactly what those strategies are. Um, like I said, this is going to be a little bit of a craps intensive trip, I hope, for me. And one of the things I wanted to do, and listen, this is one of the best things with craps. You know, yes, the actual table minimums over the last five, six years have gone up. Even walking around last night, we saw that most of the tables were at $15 minimum. But here's the difference between that and Baccarat the last few uh, trips. With craps, you have so many alternatives. You can play bubble craps, and the majority of these strategies you can play on the bubble craps machine, which is dirt cheap. But you can also play on the roll to win table, which is that plexiglass where you put your, your bets in and there's actual people rolling the dice. It's on this like plexiglass table. And then there's a third thing, which is more like a hybrid. Well, I really like that hybrid version, which is a real table, even though you're putting in your bets on a keyboard kind of, uh, you know, uh, thing. And they just put it in the Palazzo. So uh, I thought I was gonna be hunting that type of table down all over the place. And now we know after last night wandering around that they just put it in the Palazzo, which is the, um, the casino and the hotel that's connected to the Venetian. So that's awesome. So we're going to be able to play with that. And uh, this morning we'll get some breakfast. It's beautiful outside. And we'll get things rolling several places we want to hit. My dad hasn't been out to Vegas in a few years. I want to take him to see some of the new places here. So uh, we'll do another update. But I got to show you guys what this crazy... Um, uh, sweet is that we got. This is insane. I almost feel bad because it's only the two of us. And this, this, this is ridiculous. So let me see if I can switch this around. Let's see if I can do that. I guess I can't do that. All right. So let's just take a look and you guys can see this is where you come in. Let me see if I can show you guys. So this is just ridiculous. Look at this walkway, guys, inside of here, and with an entire 360 view of the strip. And there's the sphere. Pretty amazing sitting area here. And now look at this living room. Full kitchen. Full kitchen and then here is the master bedroom look at this incredible look at this master bedroom guys look at that view look at that view 
workstation so I know what I'm doing every time we go out to play, and a hot tub. So that's just a quick look, and we'll give you guys some more updates real soon. We're out of here. We got to get some breakfast. Bye-bye.